A day more than a year in the making had finally arrived in the West Texas Plains for Kenny Dillingham and his Arizona State Sun Devils as they marched into Lubbock to take on the Texas Tech Red Raiders in their first ever Big 12 Conference game. However, the result did not fall in the Maroon and Gold's favor, dropping their first game of 2024 Saturday night by a final score of 30-22. Yeah, I mean, we battled till the end. I mean, there was a little bit of, there was a little bit of frustration out there. Like, man, 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 every time we try to get back, they do score late again. Sometimes you can fight, it's not good enough. And today we weren't good enough. That's just the reality of it. Work doesn't mean you're gonna win. The Red Raiders dominated the line of scrimmage, it seemed, from the opening kickoff. And the Sun Devil offense, which had shown resiliency at times this season, couldn't gain a rhythm against the red and black defense putting Sam Levitt in the most difficult positions of his young career. However, his star running back is confident with the way him and his teammates view the long season ahead. We have three seasons this year. We got four games, a bye week, four games, and a bye week. Every, each four games needs to be a new season, no matter what happens. We can go 4-0 oh for three seasons. Why not? We're 3-1 and one right now. We have four games ahead of us. We got to focus on one game at a time. Um, we get that kid's his head cleared of these last four games, no matter wins or losses. He can make plays. He knows how to play football. He's one of the smartest guys on the team. I mean, we, we think exactly the same. I love the way the kid plays the game. Regardless of your record, whether you're 3-0 and or 0-3, one of the most critical parts of winning any football game is by winning on third down. While the Sun Devils fell short in that area, to say the least, going just 5 for 13 on third down conversions, 0 for 3 on fourth down conversions, all of which within five yards. And for Kenny Dillingham, it was his belief that following this game, it was that specific factor that was the reason why his Sun Devils fell short for the first time in 2024. We should convert fourth and ones. I mean, statistically, you should convert fourth and ones, uh, especially when the opposing team was moving the ball. You know, we haven't been as aggressive this year because we've been playing pretty good defense. And when you are, let's punt it uh, and then let's get the ball back. But that's too many snaps to play on defense. And uh, that's a testament to us not getting off the field on third down and us not converting third down. All it was was third down. Take away third down, flip it the other way, different football game, those five to six plays. Uh, we got to be able to do better. The Sun Devils now head back to Tempe for a possibly much needed bye week before they begin a two game homestand starting with the Kansas Jayhawks on October 5th. In Lubbock, Max Cepeda, Cronkite Sports.